We're just going on a little recovery walk from yesterday's uh, mountain run that we did. It was our first of the season and the spring's starting to show up and the trail conditions were pretty primed for a run. They're not great for skiing. So uh, we're going to get to that in a second, but first we have to do something that we've put off all winter. I'm going to even say almost all year. Oh, no. <laughs> hey, I have cleaned the car a few times. <laughs> this is true. But we have got to clean out our car. Yeah. Our place is always spotless. We clean it every day. But the car? I'm a little embarrassed. Yeah, me too. To be quite and honest. But I do, do oh, I want to take some like up close shots of how bad it is. I want you guys to see these crumbs. We eat in there a lot, as you've seen. But it's <laughs> me, pretty bad. Like my dog could have a full blown meal off the floors in there. And I actually give him snacks yeah, from the floor. Yeah, he gets snacks from the floor. Yeah, when he does car. something good. All right, so let's get to it. Where I think we should start is right at the dumpster. That's how bad our car is right now. <laughs> select one or more of the following options. Salt to salt yes. as the option? Yes. Yeah, salt to salt. <laughs> <laughs> when wash is ready, please pull forward into the wash. That was so embarrassing. <laughs> I had to lean out and I floored the gas when I leaned out the window. You just <laughs> rammed our little Honda if it was 12 cars behind. Uh, they, yeah, you know, now I'm stating my claim. <laughs> God, I'm so embarrassed. No, you should be. Kind of clean. Well, all that cleaning built up a hunger and a thirst. So we're in the little town of Littleton, New Hampshire. And we're gonna go to one of the uh, one of the breweries in the area that's voted some of the best beer in the world uh, year after year since they've been open, really. And that is Schilling Restaurant. They get the outside fire pit going, so we don't have to go inside, and we can enjoy this beautiful, nice day. Yeah, it's right on the Amanusik River, yeah. which is pretty sweet. And while we're hanging out doing that. Why don't you guys watch this little adventure? I'm taking an extra coat for when we get to the summit. Do you I'm have something in your- taking extra socks. Yep, that's good too. And you get an extra coat, okay. Cause it could be a lot colder up there. Thirty bucks ever. We just, if you stop in to the White Mountains and you stop in Lincoln, New Hampshire, and you're going hiking in any of the trails, make sure you stop in at the visitor center off exit 32. That's that's where we live, um, and it gets you parking in all of the White Mountain National Forest for thirty bucks. So for and a whole it, year. for a whole yeah. year, and it goes to like the maintenance of the forest, the parking areas, uh, picking up trash. If we don't litter, the price won't go up too. So if you don't buy it for thirty dollars, it's five dollars every time. So, yeah. And that's if you have $5 in your car. Yeah, <laughs> which we time. never do. So, yeah, it's just good to to get, you know, to to get it and do the right thing. I know there's a lot of people that don't do it, but it's a good thing to pay for this beautiful area and the main, you know, the maintenance of it. And yeah, just make sure you get it.
realization that skiing might just be over for the season. We've gone a couple times now and been disappointed. But then yesterday we just came out for a walk and this is actually perfect conditions for winter trail running without rolling your ankle. And normally I would say like stay away from the high traffic uh, hiking trails but they're actually perfect for winter because people pack them down for you. So we both got some new trail running shoes and some new our spikes, on. spikes. So we're gonna run up to these falls. Where was and it? we might go a little further to a shelter. Is that what we're to doing? To the Jim Liberty cabin. Jim Liberty. Uh, at the summit of Mount Shakura. So we're running up to the yeah. running up to the summit of Mount Shakura and there's a really like Nikki said, there's a really cool falls called Champney Falls. Yeah. So it's all frozen. I've never seen it because the last time we tried to do this, my blood sugar tanked and I got hungry and made sure around. <laughs> Ready? So I have uh, about 20 pounds of snacks and water in my bag, so I'm gonna run with that. How you guys doing? Hi. this place. Got a diamond. The biggest diamond in the world. Wow, I'm so surprised that nobody's found that yet. There's a million of them. Wow, so we're rich. <laughs> Like where the cliffs are? No, over here. Oh, um, I believe that's an experimental forest. I look at that all the time on the map and on Google Maps or Google Earth.
gotta keep her fed. Having <laughs> snacks with mittens on it is an art form. It is an art form. But right, here you go. You got them all? Oh, no. I picked one. What? I'm like a lizard. Wow. Yeah. I think that's a good idea. Starting to get just almost to above tree line, so the wind picked up. What'd you say? Are you cold? Your head's sweaty. I know. I sweat. It can be negative 30 and I still sweat. The way the sun's coming through here this morning is unbelievable. Starting to see more snow on the tops of the trees. We're almost to the summit. Look at the crystals, like on the ground. It's so crazy. It's so windy, almost all the needles are blown off the trees. That's pretty cool. The whole floor looks like it almost is growing grass. What'd you say? I can smell my own armpits. Oh, nice. Oh, I did it! Woo! Oh. Wow. What a perfect day to be up here. Holy cow. So bright. Behind you. trees right here are doing a really good job of blocking the wind. There's nothing right here. I can see them whipping up there. I'm cold and hungry though. All my mittens are like gross for me doing this. What a day this turned out to be. The weather is like, this is amazing weather. that YouTube had smell-o-vision because it is like, look at all this pine. Yeah, That's what it smells like. It smells like freaking Christmas in here. It's amazing. It's really strong too. I'm keeping this. Nikki's got a souvenir. Oh God. <laughs> Up you go, almost made it. Nice job. Still have that was only... oh. You want the pull? Oh, you're good.
Andy. So windy. Yeah, it, the glazed ice was just too much for the for these little guys. If we had full crampons, I'd say go, but that didn't seem safe with the amount of wind that just blew you over. <laughs> well, we'll see you another day, Summit, Mount Shakura.